Kanitsaro reaction. In the beginning we should know what is Kanitsaro reaction. Kanitsaro reaction mechanism details the method to get one molecule of alcohol and one molecule of carboxylic acid from two molecules of a given aldehyde. The reaction is executed by a nucleophilic acyl substitution on an aldehyde where the leaving group attacks another aldehyde. A tetrahedral intermediate results from the attack of hydroxide on a carbonyl. Step number 1. A nucleophile such as a hydroxide ion is used to attack the carbonyl group of the given aldehyde, causing a disproportionation reaction and giving rise to an anion carrying two negative charges. Step number 2. This resulting intermediate can now function as a hydride reducing agent. Due to its unstable nature, the intermediate releases a hydride anion. This hydride anion proceeds to attack another aldehyde molecule. Now, the doubly charged anion is converted into a carboxylate anion and the aldehyde is converted into an alkoxide anion. Step number 3. In this final step, water offers a proton to the alkoxide anion which gives rise to the final alcohol product. The reaction can proceed since the alkoxide is more basic than water. Now, the carboxylate ion gives rise to the final carboxylic acid product when acid workup is used. The acid workup is required since carboxylate is less basic than water and therefore cannot obtain a proton from water.